scientists have discovered the most distant individual star on record using NASA's Hubble Space Telescope. It's a bright behemoth they nicknamed Arendelle, Old English for Morning Star, because it existed during the dawn of the universe. Brian Welch is an astronomer at Johns Hopkins University. So normally when we look at very distant objects, what we're seeing is the light from an entire galaxy, so millions of stars all blended together. Uh, and we've been able to see those out to even further distances. But um, in this case, thanks to a very massive cluster of galaxies in the foreground, uh, the light from this one star has just been very, very highly magnified. Uh, so we're able to see this single star um, at uh, a much greater distance. Arendelle was born nearly 900 million years after the Big Bang event at the outset of the universe. Researchers said the star was estimated at 50 to 100 times the mass of our sun, while also being millions of times brighter. Its light traveled 12.9 billion years before reaching Earth. NASA astronomer Michelle Thaler. It took this wonderful cosmic coincidence. Everything was lined up perfectly. A nearby cluster of galaxies was lensing space, actually bending space into this natural telescope. That star was perfectly lined up. It was actually magnified thousands of times the brightness that it should be. In observing objects as distant as Arendelle, scientists are peering into the deep past because of the vast distance the light from the star traveled to reach Earth in a sense using Hubble as a time machine. Until now, the most distant single star on record was one named Icarus that existed four billion years after Arendelle. Arendelle itself certainly no longer exists, with such stars having relatively short lifespans according to Welch. It existed for perhaps a few hundred million years before dying in a supernova explosion.